My name is Jean-Philippe Rapp and I'm a journalist. I've been working on Swiss television and TV5 for many years and now I'm the director of the Forum Media Nord Sud. We chose that name because we generally want a forum made up of experts and journalists in equal proportions where we can say, let's put our heads together and think about a particular problem, usually a major change with implication for our future, like the development of China, global global warming or oil stocks. And this year, we've been looking at hunger. We've chosen the title La Fin du Monde. What is important to us, the core of our work, is to offer people some 50 or so films from all over the world, documentaries, dozens of seminars, special evening, get radio and television on board and say, we're pondering on such and such an issue. I know that around a billion people in the world, actually slightly more, are suffering from malnutrition and that most of them, or a lot of them, are farmers women and children. So we really have to ask ourselves what type of agricultural development it is we want. And at the meeting I went to today, I saw there was a quite natural tendency to focus on the rural media and what needs to be done in the suit. Our angle is a bit different. We say that the problem of agriculture concerns all parts of the world, not always in the same way, but still, the world world. And that climate change, for example, is likely to have a massive impact on agricultural development in China, India and Africa in the near future. And that in 25 years time, we in the West may be grappling with the malnutrition or at least have difficulty finding food. Another thing that seems crucial to me is exactly what I've just experienced here. We're holding a forum, but this time it's about a problem here in Switzerland. We are in a comfortable position, we have money from the government and the board of governors. Next year we want to take this forum somewhere else, where the problem is really acute. If all goes well, we'll be in Burkina Faso next year. Quite simple because we know that flooding that took place there recently will make the food situation really difficult next year. We'd like not only to take long what we have learned from our seminar, which is available on DVD for anyone who is interested anyway, but also to listen to what local stakeholders have to say. I'm a great believer in that. I think if the goal is to solve farmers' problems, why not start by listening to what those, those farmers have to say, farmers in our countries and the rest of the world, so that we realize that actually their problems, worries and anxieties are incredibly similar and that the solutions are going to be partly global. At least I hope so. There are concerns about rising price, the misery of land, eating habits, and all these questions are things we need to talk about together. Talking about them on our own in the north is not enough. It's the voice in the south we need to listen to. They have the most interesting things to say because they come from first-hand experience, sometimes from having to cope with an acceptable condition. So that's more or less what the Forum Media Nord Sud does, and I really want to stress that the Forum Media Nord Sud wants journalists not only to report, but also to be part of them. We do specialists, make various programs, we organize seminars and produce DVD, which we distribute free of charge to other media, if they are interested, and universities. That's what we do, because I think that's the way mentality can be changed.